Hello all, this is Emrix from Resurrection Multigaming Community. What I'm going to do today is just have a little bit of an experiment. Tomorrow I've got a new graphics card coming through as a little bit of an upgrade. But how much of an upgrade I have no idea. I hope it's going to be quite substantial because it is the new uh, GTX 680 and it's the Phantom which actually has onboard RAM of 4, massive 4 gigabytes. At the moment I've actually got the GTX 580 and that has 3 gigabyte of RAM. Now how much improvement, how much of an upgrade will it be between these two cards playing a game like Battlefield 3 which I feel is a good benchmark you know, to run. So let's have a look. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to connect to a map called the Seine uh, River. Is it Seine River? Seine Crossing? And, um, and check my settings. Right, first let's have a look. I will just press escape to go into the options and then go to the video. Okay, make sure vertical sync, vertical look normal, blah blah blah, video. Right, my, I'm running at 1920 by 1080 at 100, it's a 120 hertz monitor. That's a Dow Alienware. Uh, full screen on, vertical sync is off, field of view 70, blah blah blah. Uh, let's have a look, right. So at the moment it's set by default on ultra so can we get higher than that? I think that's about it so it's showing anti-alias and deferred four times uh, anastropic filtering so that and HBAO is on as well so that's, that gives us a good a good benchmark uh, so if I leave all those settings basically on ultra the standard setting on you know the high standard higher setting we should be able to get a good idea tomorrow uh, of a comparison between the two so here we go. Um, right back, resume. We're, we'll spawn at the East Bridge, position C. Right here we are. Let me just pick a position so we can get an FPS reading. Uh, let's have a look. Let's just do a vertical view at this corner right across the side there. Give us a good FPS. Right, next thing to do, if you're not aware, to bring up SP, uh, FPS on the screen, top right of the screen in green. You basically press the tilde key just below escape and you put in render well, in, not in capitals render dot draw fps space one as you can see top right hand corner it's given me an fps reading of 43 now that's not fantastic because this is an empty map at the moment graphics look great i've got everything up on high it looks awesome but there's no there's no uh, there's no tanks around. There's, there's, this is a 64 player server. There's no, there's no uh, people around. Uh, no explosions. No gunfire. Nothing really stressing the system at all. So 43 could easily drop, you know, below unacceptable limits, which I feel was below 30 FPS, which it can happen from time to time. So this is a, a test. So we'll be, we clearly can see if the 680 is a substantial upgrade. I think it's, I'm hoping it's going to be a pleasant surprise tomorrow. If it's only just a few FPS, I'll be very, very disappointed for the amount of money I've just paid out um, for the 680. But if, you, uh, if you're interested to see the outcome and interested to see if I wasted my money, please subscribe. And tomorrow, which will be the 29th of May, uh, you'll see the outcome. So uh, catch you there. See you later all. Cheers. Emrix.